I got a big smile on my face and let me just tell you why. So I'm just kind of watching this road behind me. It's any minute now, Chris, AKA Drunken Butcher, in case you don't follow him on Instagram or any of the social media outlets, he's on his way here. We're gonna have the biggest, coolest barbecue tonight. He's bringing his meat sprinkles. He owns his own line of meat sprinkles. If you guys don't already know that, you should know it because they're amazing. They taste so good. And we're gonna do some learning about how to cook with his meat sprinkles tonight on this video. So it's gonna be a ton of fun. I'm just watching the road back there. I know it seems kind of nerdy. Oh my gosh, you know what, actually, look at that. Here he comes. That's him coming up the road. Talk about good timing. So he's gonna be here any second. We're gonna have the coolest barbecue tonight. And uh, throughout this night and throughout this video, I'm gonna cut back and forth. What I did is I made him a Drunken Butcher deer skull, a Bone Tat signature piece with his logo on it. And we're gonna just kinda cut back and forth and make sure that we make a cool video. Great food, great fun, cool art, and the best part, good food and great people. So look, there they are. Can you tell he's a Drunken Butcher? All he's got to do is drive around town. Everybody knows it. Heck yeah. Look at that. Drunken Butcher. You guys are going to see that logo on his deer in just a little bit. Or at yeah, least a version of it. I'm stoked. Heck yeah. Oh, this is perfect. Check him out, you guys. On Facebook, at Drunken Butcher. On Instagram, at The Drunken Butcher. And uh, there's his website and his phone number. So his little catchphrase is get at me. So you better get at him. Hey, this is a drunken butcher here. You get at me now, you hear? <laughs> the what best part is the license plate. Yeah? It is. Let's check it out. Get at me. Get at me. Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> nice work. That's great. You guys ready to have some more fun? So he's got the whole family. And uh, we got most of my family here. Got my brother that's gonna be here, some of Chris's friends, and we're just gonna have a good time tonight, have some good food. We're gonna show them what a tomahawk's all about. I've never had a tomahawk, so this can be my first time, but I'm super, super, super pumped. Oh goodness. Someone else is really happy about the barbecue too. <laughs> Not just me. <laughs> Anyways, Chris has hopefully been at my house, on my back porch, cooking up some delicious meats. I talked to him a few weeks ago and we came up with this idea where we would work together and make a cool video, doing some bone tats, but also having a freaking awesome barbecue, teaching you guys how to cook and smoke delicious food using the Drunken Butcher's seasonings. So, what we're gonna do, is we're gonna cut back and forth between this video in the past and the future video with the barbecue. For the bone tats part of the video, we got this gigantic, okay, it's not gigantic, but it's a really nice four point mule deer. Look at that thing. Camera makes it look pretty big. All right, so this is what we got going on here. We got a cool drunken butcher theme to go on this little bone tats project. And uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. That's Chris's logo, the Drunken Butcher. And uh, he does some awesome, awesome meat sprinkles. We're gonna go through and we're gonna do an explanation of all of his different products as part of that video. And then we're gonna barbecue it up, show you guys how to cook it, show you the temperatures, show you all the science behind making amazing, delicious barbecued meats. This is gonna be my favorite bone test video ever. So let's get in the house and go get this thing started. It's gonna be so fun. Let's go down to the bone shop. It's a good thing we're doing the barbecue on a totally different day because guess what? This part doesn't smell so good.
got it all cut in yesterday, carved in, cut in, whatever we're going to use. And it looks pretty damn sweet. So, you guys want to take a look? Do you? Alright, let's go check it out. Beautiful looking deer. Chris, nice work for a Virginia boy. Not bad. There it is. Drunk and butcher. All cut in. Just ready for some color. But that's his logo that he had made for him. He's got the butcher's knife on the right side and then a bottle of whiskey on the on the left. Drunk and butcher. Awesome dude. Pretty excited for him to see this. Let's cut to more of the barbecue. Let's do it. Come in the house, cool down a little bit. It's nice in here. And we left Jeff with a bucket of seasonings, of course. So we've got our maple Still. madness here and we've got our house sausage seasoning. Both of these are incredible to just make sausage with, but if you'd like to just add it to the tops of your meats, salmon, incredible, mm -hmm. absolutely incredible. Yeah. Here we've got the Mediterranean meat sweats. It's gonna take you straight to the Greek Isles and it's, it's absolutely, you see, you will not find another blend like this. It's got sumac in it and you will never find a Mediterranean blend with sumac. Huh. It's, it's not a very commonly used ingredient in Mediterranean, but it adds such a pungent tartness to it. Wow. You'll see what, are you talking, what I'm talking about when you try it. Yeah, I'm excited. But it's, it's, oh, it's fantastic. It's so good. Here's my, so we've got SPG squared and we've got Moneymaker. My Moneymaker literally does not last on shelves. I cannot keep it in stock enough. And I think it's because of the lavender and the herbs that process that we're using in it. Yeah. It's just an all around fantastic. Both of these, both of these blends, these are what we use day in and day out for mm. everything. Veggies, meats, soups. Um, we put it on our eggs. I mean, mm. literally everything. Everything. Yeah. Wow. You could eat it straight if you wanted to. Some people do. And that's the money maker? The money maker. Money maker. Sweet. So we've got a handful of these blends on the meats out there on the grill. Here in about an hour and a half, two hours, we're gonna slice them up and see what we got. Sweet, dude. So right here, we've got the, the money maker. Yeah, okay, see all that's the greens, the money maker. got here. a couple little lavender petals in there. Dang, dude. And on the tri-tip in the back, or sorry, the, the tomahawk in the back, that is SPG squared. Uh, right here, we've got SPG squared. Notice how big that garlic gets from what it was. It soaks up and get about three times as big. Uh, we've got money maker on a tri-tip back there. This is a spicy steak blend. Um, I can't say soon, the name. Soon to yet. be released. Yeah, right? it's going to be released within the next week. Can't say the name. Um, and then right here we've got an ancho chipotle blend. So it's really smoky, really smoky, really? kind of peppery. It's going to be real good. And I, again, I can't say the name of that one, but I promise you they're going to be showstoppers. And then we got this delicious jalapeno, jalapeno poppers, poppers and cream and cheese, and some cheddar cheese in there. Man. Smoke them up, and then once we start throwing everything on the grill, we'll throw them on the grill too and get that bacon just a little bit crispy. Mm. We're going to eat good tonight. Heck yeah. Let's close that up and let us do it magic, and we'll get back to you here shortly. Back to you shortly. In fact, while we're waiting for the meats to cook, let's check out some bone tats. Some creation yeah, of Chris's skull. Yeah. So I'm always down to see some bone tats. We're going to just segue back and forth between the meat cooking and the skull carving. And then at the very end of the night, when the food has been consumed and our bellies are fat and we're happy, that's when the coup de gras happens. The coup de gras. Yep. Then we'll be able to, see, to the... see my skull. I'm so excited. <laughs> The big reveal. I'm, I'm at the house where it is, but I can't see it. So. <laughs> soon. Yeah, soon. A few hours. Very soon. Yes, sir. Welcome back, you guys. So the meat's been cooking. As you guys have been seeing. The, the bone tats have been cooking too, in a sense. And so now we're gonna go back to the good stuff, the barbecue. Let's go see what's going on. All right, Chris, what's what we got going? going? So we've got the tri tips on the sear. So they smoked for what? About an hour, an hour and a half. half. 
And now we're just doing a little reverse sear on there to get a nice little crust and mm. pull them off and do the tomahawks. So this is the secret sauce, so this these, is the secret sauce. Yep, these two are the secrets. secrets, this is SPG squared and this is Moneymaker here. Okay, Moneymaker, let's see. Moneymaker, right here, Moneymaker. Just to be downwind of this right now, it smells amazing. It does smell amazing. And then the SPG squared right there. So tell the camera real quick what the difference then was between this SPG and the SPG squared. So SPG was our first blend that we came out with. It's got just salt, pepper, garlic, nothing more, nothing less. Now, we started getting reviews after, you know, months of it being available to the public, and uh, they were all positive, and people started saying, oh man, we love more garlic in it. So I came out with SPG Squared. It's got two and a half times the garlic and less salt. Gotcha. Garlic lover's paradise. So, yeah. Absolutely incredible that roasted garlic does for stuff. I know. So again, that's the SPG Squared. And just look at that goodness. Tons of garlic. Real marks say what? Yeah. Just another minute or two on this side. We'll pull them and let them rest while we do the tomahawks. Mm -hmm. Those are only for Jeff. Those are only for Jeff and I, by the way. <laughs> That's right. Video's rolling. I want you to show us what we got. You ready to start slicing? We got the tomahawks here about to make a mess through the plates. Oh my gosh. They're just juicing out. <laughs> One would say, uh, moist. <laughs> <laughs> That's just one word that people you know, might say. We've got the tri tip sitting over here, uh, resting out, all tucked in nice. So, resting so that all the juices can it redistribute, will right? Redistribute into the meat, and actually, we're ready to slice as soon as we get a cutting board. We'll slice and start pulling out all the food. Slicing and dicing, yeah. Okay. Awesome, you guys. Welcome back. Now it's the good part. Now it's the part where we see a little bit of the, the end result, the feast part. That's right. So, we're going to show you guys the meat out here in the sun where we can see nice and clear and everything looks so juicy. Dude, that looks so good. Junk of Butcher, the good meat right now. What do you say, Chris? Hey, we're getting down good here at Bone Tats Casa tonight. It's going to be some good eating. Everybody's going to have a case of the meat sweats. And the meat sweats. All the goods. All the good food. So you guys got to make sure that you go to the drunkenbutcher.us, right? Yes, sir. Drunkenbutcher.us. Order yourself just buckets of this stuff because it's so good. Gavin, you excited for some food? Yeah? So this is one of the mystery ones. This is soon to be released, top secret. What do you think? So good. So good. I just, I just stole a little bit. Hey, let me just show you. Let that was power you. pack. And people are going to say it's dry, but look at this. Not dry. Not at all. Mm. So good, dude. I'm excited about that one. That one just blew my mouth away. It's got that kind of earthy, really smoky. Uh-huh. Amazing. Yes. So I just want to show you guys how dry it is. It's it's awful. If you can see that. See mild dry is me. It's just awful. Just awful. awful. It's so dry. So I mean dry. this is like Thanksgiving turkey out of your nightmares. Yep. White meat off the Thanksgiving turkey. Awful. Just <laughs> absolutely awful. <laughs> Like that dry. Oh my gosh. All right, so this is Moneymaker. I'm gonna, ooh, I get the end. Get the that juice. means I get all the seasons right there. That's going in my mouth right now. <laughs> so good. So good. Lindy, I wanna see what you think. This is my daughter, Lindy, by the way. Everyone say hi to Lindy. I am recording. Yes, I am. <laughs> am I alive? Is that what you just asked me? He was live on Instagram. <laughs> no, no. This is not Instagram. This is my mom. Hello, everybody. My dad. Guys, what do you think? 
juicy. I mean, so good, huh? What do you think? So good. Each time I've eaten a piece of, like, th the one you just start cutting, it's my new favorite. So this one is the spicy steak seasoning. That's a lot. To this be one, released. To be released. As yet By unnamed. the time this video comes out, these seasonings will be available. Mm. It's gonna be bad. That's how good this is. If it falls on the ground, who cares? You eat it. There is no five second rule uh -huh. here. Uh -huh. da, 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 da. Yeah. The big reveal. Here comes the tomahawk steaks. Which I didn't know, but I guess it's a ribeye, right? With the bone long, attached. A long bone ribeye. A long bone ribeye, let's see. He doesn't just make sprinkles, he knows his meat, because he's a butcher. Dude, I just want to fist that thing. It might be thumbnail right here. I might want to just fist that thing and just start eating. <laughs> right? <laughs> just kind of like... <laughs> Here, let's get a picture. That's awesome. Yeah, I gotta get it in portrait mode. There you go. All right, let's cut them. Let's cut them babies. They're probably gonna be completely just Disgusting. awfully well done. I don't think anybody else is gonna want any of this. Just, just Jordan and I are the only ones that want this one. Nope, sorry, not well done. <laughs> All right, so we'll cut this little vein of fat off right here. Eat the Cheetos and I'll let you go. Uh, how would you like your slices? Just, just so that it can be eight. That's all I care about. It's more point. than medium, but that's or medium rare, but that's all right. Yeah, that looks so good. Oh, 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 sorry. Still juicy. I'm gonna steal a little piece right yep, there, even though you're close. Oh man. Oh man. A little piece just became a little bigger. <laughs> And then a little bigger still. Dude, un unbelievable. There you go. Beautiful. Long bone ribeye. Yep. Also known as a tomahawk. Oh man. Mm. Almost makes you want to cry. It's so good. Yeah. Yeah. You ready for you ready for a serious kick in the mouth? Yep. I've already had about 12, but I'm ready for another one. So we'll take this little money maker. Fat off. There's a good bit of meat on there, so we keep that. Mm -hmm. These weren't terribly fatty. I trimmed them up a little bit. Too. Think. Oh. No. <laughs> yes, it's way good. Ah, oh, darn it, I would be spilled. Yes. Yes, sir. It's a resounding yes, sir. Absolutely. You guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for following along. Make sure, in case you don't already, here's our plug real quick for Instagram and your website and all that stuff. Uh, the Instagram is the underscore drunken underscore butcher. Uh, Facebook is just the drunken butcher. Okay. Get at me. <laughs> Get at him for real. This stuff is unbelievably good. Well, Chris here, I think him with his company and his personality and everything that he has to offer, he's going somewhere, you guys. Count on it. You'll see. Well, we made it to Salem at least. We made it to Salem. Oh, hey. hey, that's just the first step on a long journey to success. So, wish the best for But him. it's good guys like this right here willing to go out of their way and help somebody out that yeah. brought this whole thing together. Hey, people have helped me. I don't really have much of a platform. It's a pretty small scale, but, right? It's just people helping people. It's just, exactly. we're just, we're just industry friends making a name for ourselves and helping each other along the way. Absolutely. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate you coming all the way up here and cooking this amazing meal for us. It's not too many people would come to your house and cook for you. No, dude, we're gonna do this once a week, right? Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> awesome, man. All the good food, guys. Enjoy it. The what? This is Moneymaker Cutter Kelly. It's the coup de gras. Chris hasn't seen it yet. He's fed us so good. It's time to reward that boy. <laughs> so, as you guys have been watching on this video, you've been able to see the culmination of number one making this art piece for Chris. Well, number two, him making his own art piece for us in this big barbecue. So fun when you can just kind of bring two different platforms together, do these collaborations, and uh, just have a great time together. But that's what it's really all about. <clears throat> it's really just about the friendships that I've been making through Bone Tats and stuff like that. It's just been so rewarding for me. And uh, so I'm just really excited to be meeting people like me with similar interests. And uh, he's so excited over there. He's like, his legs are bouncing up and down. <laughs> so let's, uh, no more speech. Let's just go get it. That's cool. Oh, you can put them out in there for me. Thanks. You ready to see? I don't know. Yeah. 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 That's incredible. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <clears throat> Even got your autograph on there. Well, it's out. <laughs> The logo came out really good, didn't it? Dude, that came out incredible. Now it's done! Absolutely incredible. I don't know what to say, dude. <laughs> Better in person, yeah? Come here, bro. <laughs> Thanks, man. Uh, I appreciate that. Yeah, absolutely. All yours, buddy. This is awesome. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> you don't really realize how absolutely incredible these things are awesome i should probably change up from saying incredible so much but you don't really realize the amount of depth and character it brings until you see it in person so all you got to do is cook really good food and people like this will do <laughs> amazing, amazing stuff for you, for you. <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> thanks Jim. yeah my pleasure you guys thank you for watching We'll catch you on the next one. Get at me.